Hey guys, it's Will from Will's Fifth Quarter Special here. Just headed into work, waiting for the train. So, want to hop on a Facebook Live with you guys, uh, talk a little White Sox, and it's just kind of hard to understand why Rick Khan is sitting. Now we don't know what's going on, obviously, within a few hours, but the perception he's giving to White Sox fans is, you know, I didn't notice we lost two to one to a bad Royals team and gave up bad base running, bad hitting, um, bullpen still pretty pathetic. Aside from Jimmy Lambert, who did good last night, but you can go get a Michael Givens sheep. You can go get a left-handed bat and Ian Happ from the Cubs right on the other side of town to help out. Get one lefty bat and a reliever, at least, Rick. White Sox fans deserve better from you. You didn't deliver enough in the offseason, which is a good reason and set up why this team is underperforming the way they are this year. When we're supposed to be contending towards a World Series title, possibly, and moving forward in the playoffs. Clock's ticking, Rick. I don't know what you're doing here, but, uh, you know, here was for a special. I'm going to be honest here. Rick Khan is not the right GM for the White Sox right now. I think he is um, a little too f afraid to make a move, and you can't do that as a general manager in baseball. you got to be smart and take a risk. Now, maybe you learn from taking a risk uh, trading away Tatis. Sure, but you missed out on Harper. You could have had him years ago. You missed out on uh, Soto, even if it would cost a lot. Go get smart moves. Look at what Atlanta did last year. That GM was smart. Their team is in a similar spot to where we are right now. They had a losing record going to the trade deadline last year. And what did they do? They made smart moves. Now, Jake Diekman. All right, Rickon, gold star. Great move. But you're going to need more than just one reliever to fix this roster. Jose Ruiz in the bullpen. He's garbage. Uh, Bennett Sousa and Banks, who we'd seen in the bullpen. Garbage. We could use another starter. Davis Martin, okay, great, but maybe one more. You could also use a left-handed bat. Go get a bench guy. I don't care who it is. Will score special lands, but I'm going to be honest here with you. The White Sox need to get it together. Rick Khan, clock's ticking, man. Uh, I don't think your fan base is going to be very happy with another uh, excuse response to why we weren't apparently as aggressive. You know, when you say, oh, uh, we tried all we can. We... We, we like the team we have. Okay, great. But how's that team doing right now? Underperforming. Mediocrity. This team is mediocre. It's not even funny. Now, do they have a lot of games left? They're only three games back? Yes, but we'll score special fans. White Sox fans have a right to be angry right now at their general manager. Their general manager is failing this ball club. I mean, I'm going to leave you guys with a question. And I think I thought about it a lot um, up to the trade deadline with this team. Anything could happen, of course, expect the unexpected, but Rick Khan takes all those years to make smart trades through the rebuild, gets his team into contention within the last two years, first round playoff exits each year, goes into it saying we're going to be aggressive in this trade deadline, we're going to make smart moves for this team. Now, you can't help injuries, yes, but Giolito, not doing much. The rotation's not doing much. You pay Lynn and trade a guy in Dane Dunning who had more potential through this uh, contention. You trade last year. Nick Madrigal was not doing well, but you wouldn't have an issue at second base if you traded a Nick Madrigal. It's all these things that are stemming into what's now known as mediocre White Sox baseball. I hate to say it, guys, but I can be as optimistic as I want, but this team is not performing the way they're supposed to. So... Uh, you can blame a manager, sure, but it's the players that play the game, but it's most importantly the blame goes to general manager Rick Hahn. So Rick, blame's on you, buddy. Get it done in the next few hours, get something done, or uh, you might be on the chopping block and uh, applying for resumes. So, so long from this Emergency Facebook Live Willis Score Special. Rick Hahn, tune in, check this out, get the job done. Do your job as a general manager. Stop sitting on your butt eating Pringles or something and you know, watching White Sox highlights from last year's team. This year's team is this year's team. We're not last year's team. This isn't 2021 anymore. This is 2022. You need to get this team in good shape to start winning.